All right, boys, we got George's buggy. We're doing some work to it. We got the trail dogs in the house. Make sure you guys hit the like, share, and subscribe button so we can get all the content out there. The more people to see the videos, hopefully the more people we can help. Thanks for watching. Let's get started on the video. All right, guys, we got George's buggy. We're about to put the Rockzillas on. It's unsupported. We're gonna do some ground clearances before. And if you look, He's right at 18 inches on the dot, maybe a tad over if you really want to get technical. So 18 inches in the front. Now we're going to go to the rear. Going to the rear. He's about 16 and a quarter, safely 16 and a quarter. And uh, we're gonna go the width now. AJ, you're gonna hold it from the outside of this tire, right there. And I'm going to the same spot on this tire right here. He's about 72 and a half inches. 72 and 5 8. 72 and a half in the front back. Let's go around to the front. Same time, same spot, I mean. You in the same spot? Yeah, I think so. Alright, the, the front is a little narrower. It's 69 inches. So that's where we're at with the uh with the stocks. With the 30 inch, he's got about 200 miles on these tires. And uh, we're going to go ahead and swap it over, skip all that stuff, and uh, show you after he's let his suspension settled, and we'll get back to you. All right, now, now we're going to go ahead and do the second part of the video. We're going to do the front, back, and the current ones that we got going on. So we're going to start with the back here. I'm going to lean it this way. George is going to lean it back to me. 59. That's pretty much what we're consistently getting with it. These are hard to measure because they're so knobby. So 59 for the back. There's 59, so y'all don't. I think I'm playing games with the trickery of the camera. Now here's the front wheel. 57.2, we're gonna get a double reading here. Check it out one more time. 57.2, and these read, I think 61, but we'll go ahead and double check it. There's 61. All right, we're gonna balance it one more time, George. I'll take the front, I'll take this side. You take that side. We'll just balance it. 61. All right. Next, we're gonna do the measurements. So hold on for that. All right. Now we're back. We're gonna do the after measurements. Now that we got the Rockzillas on, we took it for a ride. I got the suspension set. I'll move that back a little bit. Yeah, right there. He's a little over 19, we'll call it 19 and a quarter. So he picked up about an inch and a quarter in the front. Now let's measure the width in the front while we're here. On the outside? Yep. About 73 inches. He was about 69, so he picked up... We might have messed up that measurement at the beginning. Because there ain't no way he picked up four inches. But we'll blame that one on AJ. We'll go to the back. I know he got the back right because I showed him where to put the tape measure. So we were 72 and a half on the back. Now we are right at 73 and a half. So we picked up an inch in the back. And now we're going to measure the rear ground clearance. We're about 18, just under 18 and a half, we'll call it 18 and 3 eighths. So, 18 and 3 eighths, when he was 16, 16 and a quarter. So he picked up two inches of ground clearance. Yeah, he, uh, now he's 74. Did we measure the width yet on the back? We did. Yeah, so he so he gained a little bit of track width. He's about 
inch and a half wider, and then you got about roughly two inches of ground clearance all the way around, inch and a half or so ground clearance he added. So the buggy looks sharp now, and we're ready to do some riding. My buggy's next.